These are the dumbest criminals caught on camera. It's hard to believe this actually happened. This criminal took his time to hide his face from the cameras he knew were watching him, but halfway through his attempted break-in, he took a quick peep to see if the camera was still watching. It was. These thieves did their research. They even knew where the security cameras were. At least they thought they did. Sometimes a little bit of pre-planning can save you a lot of time and effort. Man. After catching a glimpse of himself in the mirror, this thief decided today wasn't a good day to break the law. When you're outsmarted and get locked in the very store you're trying to rob, you know it's game over. This was the world's easiest arrest for these policemen. Here we go again. Of all disguises you can wear to fool a CCTV, what would you rate as the worst? Do you think a plastic bag would be up there with other terrible ideas? <laughs> These criminals made a spectacular entrance to this electronics store, only to fail miserably on the exit. Someone give their window cleaner a raise. Medic! What's the best way to get free money? An ATM, right? I guess they're reinforced for a reason. Not even the tow bar of a minivan can pull it free. I've heard of hiding goods under your hoodie for inconspicuous shoplifting, but this is on a whole other level. <laughs> yeah, boy. Some people will try and steal anything. Like this harebrained guy who thought no one would notice a chainsaw hidden under his t-shirt. I am a super genius. This furry burglar got in her full getup for this home invasion. Except she got a little hot at one point and exposed herself on camera. <laughs> When he stole a bunch of packages off someone's front porch, he rewarded police with a little victory dance and his full face on camera. Thank you very much. When you have a sweet tooth calling, only 300 gumballs will do. This criminal severely overestimated the size of his target. Bye, have a great time. The worst place you can possibly try and steal something is a police station. This guy didn't get the memo and found himself at the receiving end of a red-handed arrest. This guy thought the best way to rob a jewelry store was by walking in the front door and smashing display cabinets with a rock. He didn't count on the reinforced glass and ran out empty-handed. No, 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 no. These three guys do a pretty good job distracting the store clerk while their friend steals two phones at the back. It should have been the perfect crime, except for the CCTV capturing their every move. Busted. This thief had it all worked out. He'd ransack a phone store in the middle of the night. Everything was going great. A few moments later. Until he realized he was now trapped inside the store he was trying to flee. Armed robberies usually work better when you have an actual weapon, not just a finger under your shirt. While he might have made off with $300, he showed his face on camera and was quickly arrested. This, this, this is not okay. This needs to stop now. The first rule in stealing something is leaving with it in one piece. Judging by their performance, it's no surprise they were caught just a day later. <laughs> When you try to rob a locked beer fridge, it will always leave you feeling a little crushed. Sometimes the person who steals your packages is the person living right next door to you. After a lengthy foot race, this genius chose the wrong path that ended up going nowhere fast. At least he got some good exercise. Another day, another ATM theft attempt. This genius forgot to tie the rope to his truck. This guy doesn't even care that it's broad daylight. He just goes ahead and climbs into the car as though it's his. Once he realizes all that was useless, he just gives up and walks away. Cool. This daredevil didn't count on two guard dogs who were trained to defend their property. Sometimes that chicken looks so good, you just have to help yourself to a serving of your own. Unfortunately for him, it didn't go unnoticed. This late night trespasser spent forever smashing and climbing his way through a glass door, when he could have just reached around and let himself in. This world record shoplifter can fit an unnaturally heavy slab of drinks under her dress and carry it like it's nothing. 
When you go on a beer run, always remember to pay and tighten your belt or this happens. <laughs> no, 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 no. This guy thought he'd try the oldest trick in the book. Try on some expensive jewelry and run out the front door. It's clear the owners had trouble with thieves before. Can't handle the heat, my friend. Not even priceless art is safe from dumb thieves. This man thought he could hide a painting under his jacket and simply stroll out of a gallery unnoticed. I'm a bad boy. Bike thieves aren't afraid of daylight robbery, even from the back of your car. This rear dash cam captured the very unsuccessful attempt from a very unaware criminal. Armed robberies work best when you can keep your weapon firmly in your hand. This robber practically handed the clerk his gun before running out kung fu style. After being arrested and detained for questioning, this teen was left alone for mere seconds before making this daring second floor escape. Too bad the cops already have your name. This guy was determined to get into a locked door without a key. He spent almost three hours trying to kick the door in, only to get absolutely nowhere. Wait till he figures out he just needs to pull the door instead. Good gravy. This genius tried to steal a display bike from a bicycle shop. Not only was he not quick enough, but the bike he was trying to steal had hey. no pedals. Mission failed. We'll get him next time. Normally, thieves climb fences to steal what's secured behind them. This guy wanted to steal the whole gate itself. Every now and then, porch pirates strike gold, like this one who found a TV on someone's doorstep. If only he'd planned ahead with a car big enough to carry it. Uh -oh. These mallet-wielding maniacs have never heard of reinforced glass. You gotta give them points for effort, though. At one point, you gotta cut your losses and run. This thief was trying to steal electrical cables from a high-rise when he became trapped on top of an air conditioning unit four floors up. After two days stuck, he was eventually helped to safety. When this crook managed to reach through and grab a cash register tray, he thought he hit payday, but his spatial awareness could use some work. When this guy decided to steal a mattress, he was just lucky it was there to cushion his awkward fall just seconds later. <laughs> what seemed like a flawless break-in was followed up by the worst getaway ever. It's almost hard to believe that this actually happened. <laughs> when a single kebab wasn't enough, this guy tried to steal the whole roll. When the police finally caught up to the truck, the reason for them running became pretty obvious. What good is a brazen Ram Raid robbery if you only steal worthless display models instead of the hundreds of brand new boxed iPhones out back? When you've been robbed multiple times, sometimes leaving a trap is the best way to catch a criminal. This locked corridor served as the perfect cage for an unwanted thief. This guy would do anything for a Pepsi. Anything except pay, that is. And when the doors locked behind him, he figured a hundred shoulder barges would do the trick. This man used his kid for cover while he hit a stolen laptop down his pants. I guess some people have no shame. I think we can confidently say that the mystery of the missing houseplants has finally been solved. These criminals must have thought there were some Mission Impossible style lasers defending this bar when they broke in. There weren't lasers, but there were cameras recording their every worm-like move. After robbing a travel agent, Mother Nature did her best at slowing down this criminal as much as possible. And just like that, his money was gone with the wind. A little help, please. You can tell times are tough when people are out there stealing lawn furniture. These two thieves were captured on camera stealing a bench from the porch of a family's house. After this thief broke into a computer store, he quickly discovered that anti-theft cables exist. Looks like he might just leave empty-handed. All this guy wanted to do was look at a $17,000 wedding ring in sunlight. But instead of returning inside, he simply walked away. Luckily, camera footage was able to identify him. ATM thieves aren't the sharpest tools in the shed. These ones managed to jimmy open the front panel of this ATM before getting spooked and driving away. These two shoe thieves were picking the best footwear to steal before they were caught and made their escape. 